Yeah. You say come, you go remove her. Yeah. Your wife will hold that one. When I walk on this wedding, I go prize this you now. They tell me say now only politician and rich one is not the buyer. Say Jesus. Now you wear a hey god. <laughs> you they even they use a run. <laughs> if I wear this you now, this you will wear me. Okay, can I have a? Uh, it's very painful, right? Okay, where's the shoe? Uh, I won't pull on the phone. Uh, 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 sorry, my friend. Uh, can we get the light here? All right, please. For us to enjoy this game, please, can we take our seat? Please, secretary, sit down. Please, guys, take your seat, please. Let's you are the one writing names of people who spray and who did not spray. Can you sit down, please? You old, you old red barrel and blue barrel. Like, say they work for you, Bill. Okay. All right. Can I have one left, please? Mark, please. No, you hold one. I see, no, 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 where is the other one leg? Oh, yeah, uh, please. Can I get the other leg, please? Yeah. Please put yourself in a shoe now. Oh, sorry, remove the shoe. Thank you. If I drop this, uh, I will try to... Uh, so then, yeah, no? Thank you. Oh, yeah. But you see what... Uh, now, one hand here, one hand here. Beautiful. All right. Please, can we be sitting, please? Thank you. So that you enjoy the game, please. Please, Ogami, sit down, sit down. That is why when I tell people, buy good phone, you will not buy good phone. Good phone should zoom from your comfort. You will be using IT. All right, this is how the game works, right? Uh, okay, I'll be asking questions. When, if I ask a question and it is your wife, you raise a shoe. If it's you, you raise your shoe. Same thing to you, right? If I ask any question, if it's your husband, you raise your husband's shoe, right? If it's you, if it's both. Are you ready? Okay. This game is beautiful. Let's have fun. Let's have fun. Now, I'm asking my first question. Hmm. Who crossed first? Who is the first person to cross on the other? <laughs> Dun, 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 dun. Hey, no, no looking back. Sorry. I like this. Uh, who crossed on the other face? The first day. Wow. Mona clap. Now, if they get a Korean, now clap. That's the beauty of it. Beautiful. <laughs> who asked for the first date? The first date. <laughs> Shoot your shot. Shot your shot. At the date, who came late? No, we got, uh, 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 we got there together. Okay. Oh, you went there together? Yeah. <laughs> who said I love you first? The, eh, 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 eh. Even she blessed me, no. Okay, I tell you the game is interesting. Who initiated the first kiss? Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Who forget the first? No, 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 no. Who want to know more about you guys, man? Oh, my God. Okay. Oh Isn't that beautiful? Why you ask me what I'm asking? Where, where, your, where your friends even know? Right? Okay. All right. All right. Let's go. Who wakes up first in the morning? Nice one. Wow. Now, 7 zero. Okay. Let's go. It's getting hotter. Who is the best cook? F zero. <laughs> uh, in every relationship, there must be first square. Who started the first square? Ah, uh, Baba, you win for battle. Baba, I know the finish. Oh, oh, can you see that? Can you see? Oh, it's getting interesting. Okay. Can you drop your hand? Okay, drop your hand. Now, after the first square, who says sorry first? Oh, uh, eh, 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 okay, okay, okay. I want to ask a better question here. All right. 
who spends the most? <laughs> wow, Baba right who? Answer. Who saved the most? <laughs> wow, ah, nice one, wow, nice one, wow, nice wow, nice wow, nice wow, 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 wow. That's a beautiful one. Nice one, nice one. Okay, let's go to the city room. Who always hold the remote? Who, 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 who eat the most? Eat. <laughs> Who's the best driver? Who drive rough the most? Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. <laughs> wow. Like oh, <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, you guys are going for an appointment. Who delay most for going out? First time in the history. Mad it. Are you kidding me? Okay. Now I want to ask a very controversial question. Now this is the question. Who are the most annoying friends? Hello? Oh, we are waiting for you. Your wife don't raise you. Mm -hmm. He shock you. Mm. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, I'm politically correct. That's beautiful. Okay, now. Let's ask a love question. That's the last question. This is the question. In the whole wide world, who do you love the most? Beautiful, 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 beautiful. All right, to crown it all, you guys are actors, right? Now, let's have a scene of French kiss. You are shooting right now. Let's, oh yeah, now drop your shoe. Drop your shoe. But uh, you guys are best actor, right? Now, give us the rule. Of French kissing. It's been part of John. Woo! With you. I saw you one time in the end. I just knew it was you. But then the human in me kept on fighting. <laughs> Fighting very hard to resist. Pastor, quiet, please. Thank you. Quiet, please. But the human in me kept fighting what would later become my truth. Those who are close to us know the truth. It's been seven years with you, babe. Someone asked me today, why you? I told the person that I'm not just good looking. I'm a superstar and I'm one of the finest men in Africa. But, but that also means that I have been with all kinds of women. But in the last 10 years, Peggy is the only person that I have realized that I just cannot live without. Hold on, people. As much as we talk love, as much as we want to say the fancy things, I really like you. You know how I get when you want to drive out and go for an appointment. I get asking, ah, babe, so you're going out now? Babe, you're living now? It's not like you're doing anything for me. I just want you around the house. Most times you're downstairs monopolizing the remote as always and I'm upstairs. But knowing that you're downstairs, you're just in that house, gives me peace. 
when I made up my mind to get married, I was looking out for companionship. I wasn't looking for a wife. I was looking for a soulmate and a best friend. You have been my best friend for the longest. And that is why even when we fight, both of us cannot foolishly live without each other. You're not coming, eh, hey, babe, life has finished too. And I, eh, I'll send you the pin. Just because we miss ourselves, baby, I am going to hold your hands even when we're 90. Aww. I love you. Shields. Even God knows that I love you. Aww. With all of my heart, baby. You mean everything to me. Like you are my friend. Do you understand? Like you're my guy. You're my guy. The kind of gossip we gossip. The kind of gist. But then you inspire me. I was not feeling Lord when you met me. When you looked at me and told me you're born a star. Keep up to it. Keep doing your thing, baby. You'll be great. Today I'm a national treasure. But when I look by my side, you have to be that woman beside me. You are my everything, baby. And I'm happy to call you Mrs. Leonard. Even though you don't understand what is happening here, put your hands together for the place. Wow. Wow. This is the first Rubuget that is very emotional. This is a round of applause for her once again. Uh -uh. That's a beautiful one. That's a beautiful one. That's a beautiful one. That's a beautiful one. Beautiful one. Uh -huh. With what? Okay. Uh, please. Uh, Peggy. I know you have something to say to us. Let's go. <laughs> it's tough. It's shook. It's shook. Uh, um, I don't know what to say, but Frederick, you and I met years back. Something shook. And. First, I was on the movie set and I was new. I just sat in one corner and all the top actors were just oppressing me. Frederick walked past me and said, Are you okay? Are you okay? And it was the first time somebody was asking me if I was Aww. okay. So I was like, Yeah, yeah, I'm okay, I'm fine. So we passed. And then on another day, I saw Frederick. I wanted to shoot a movie. And you know, the director, AGK, are you here? God bless you. Um, and he insisted that Frederick could play the role. So Frederick came, and Frederick, Frederick just was there for me. Um, as entertainers, we all know that people always, um, they're always selfish. They think of just themselves. But Frederick was just one person that just wanted everything to go right even though he didn't know me. So after that movie, I called him up and I said, can you tell me more about yourself? Aww. And then he told me and I was inspired. Babe, I don't want to go through everything. You, have, you and I have been through a lot. It's been a lot of struggles. It's been a lot of breakups as well. <laughs> um, You've gone, I've gone, I've come back, you've come back. You are like a father to me, but my father is here, and I love you, Daddy. I love you, Mommy. <laughs> but Frederick is, Frederick is my best friend, even though he can be very controlling. <laughs> Uh, but Frederick loves me. I've seen you fight so many people for me. I've seen you say, I've seen people say, why not an Igbo girl? And I've seen you say, it is Peggy. 
and for that my husband. I will love you. I will learn to be a better woman. Babe, I will never be perfect. I will still fight you. <laughs> I will still protect you. I have protected protected you from the first day we met. When I met Frederick, Frederick was not this female that everybody know. But I see on the internet and everybody say, Peggy, you're lucky, Peggy, you're lucky. People don't know what I've been through. I have stood by this man. But most importantly, I have met a man who says, Peggy, I will take care of you. Be patient. He promised me that he's going to spoil me. And Frederick has been spoiling me, silly. And I just hope that this goes out to the internet. Every girl should be patient. I have been patient. I have always been a hardworking woman. All my friends know. You you understand. Um, but when I met Frederick, I saw a man that was willing to to make money. I saw a man that is not a womanizer. And most importantly, that is why I stayed for the small babe. Please don't change. Frederick is one man I can beat my chest on, despite what everyone is saying, that he doesn't womanize. That's true. Sometimes I get on his nerves and he thinks that I'm taking him for granted. Maybe I'm not. I'm just a woman. We can be silly sometimes. But I will love you. I will respect you. Amen. You will always be the crown on my head. You will be the man I ask for decisions before I make it. To everybody that you have fought my case for, God will fight your case for you. Amen. Thank you for waking up in the morning and saying, babe, let's pray. Frederick, as much as you look good, you make me want to love God the more. Frederick doesn't stop praying. Sometimes I feel bad that I don't pray enough. <laughs> Frederick wakes up in the morning, he prays. He wakes up at night, he's praying. And I said, this is a good man. And when I met Frederick, Smartin, he had a girlfriend. But then I looked at his future and I said, this guy is going to make it. Peggy, stay. And to tomorrow, Frederick asked me, how did you know that I will get here? So to everybody, every young lady out there, if you have a guy that you like, you love him, he doesn't have money, please stay. Hey, vice versa. <laughs> Him. Listen to him, encourage him. That is all that I have done all these years. I don't want to get any. It got to, it got to a point I thought that Frederick would not marry me. I'm like, Frederick, I'm a fine girl, you're wasting my time. <laughs> and he'll be like, Wait, 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 wait. I know there are rich guys chasing you. I will marry you. And babe, this has been a long journey. You will always be my best friend. Amen. If we don't fight, who will I fight with? <laughs> Frederick will be shooting. I will call him for minor things. He say, babe, I'm shooting. I say, hey, what, what do you want me to tell? Thank you for being a brother to me. Thank you for being my best friend. Thank you for being my supporter. Thank you for standing by me. Thank you for not seeing me as um, someone who is not from your tribe, but you yet, yes, babe. And remember when I met Freddie, everybody like, he will not marry, he's an Anambra guy, you. Anambra people don't marry robots. 
But Frederick has kept to his promise. And babe, in front of the world and everyone that is witnessing today, I want to say that from the belly of my heart, from, from the deepest, deepest of her, baby, not my long talker like you, but you know that I love you. Thank you for planning our finance. Thank you, thank you for making, uh, making sure that we grow together. Thank you for holding my hands and saying, babe, you are going to make a big mistake. Don't do this. I appreciate you. I'll always be a stubborn girl. You have to do with it for the rest of your life. You will always be a stubborn man, and I will do with it for the rest of life, my life. But I will never cheat on you. I know that's your biggest fear. I want to say that God has blessed us. You and I know that God has blessed us. And we are grateful to God. He has blessed you. He has blessed me. And I want you to know that I love you. I will always love you. No matter what happens. Ours will be different. Amen. They say entertainers' marriage don't last. We will last. If we last, if we last. We will be an inspiration to the younger ones. Amen. <laughs> we would love each other. We will show people how it is to love one another. Amen. We will have the number of kids we want. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> and for everyone that is here to witness our love, thank you. It's been seven years. Seven years now. And Frederick Leonard, I am now your wife. I love you and God bless you for me. Amen. That's a beautiful one. Put your hands together. Just put your hands together. Just put your hands together. Just put your hands together. Uh, this is more than a wedding. Inside the wedding, we have a motivating stories, motivational things, encouragement words. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So, good night. Thank you. Enjoy your life. Have fun. Inspiration. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.